In this second example, the transfer function you're looking to draw the body plot for is 1 over s plus 0 0.1. Let's just start by writing this transfer function in the standard form we need for body plot. That is, we need s plus 1. This can be rewritten as 1 over, let's factor 0 0.1, this s over 0 0.1 plus 1, g of s equals to 10 over s over 0 0.1 plus 1. The body plot will show the 20 log of this function, 20 log of 10 over s over 0 0.1 plus 1 is equal to 20 log of 10 plus 20 log of 1 over s over 0 0.1 plus 1. This means that we can now split this body plot into two parts, into two building blocks, a constant gain and a real pole. Let's just start with the constant gain. 20 log of 10 is 20, so that will give a constant value on the body plot for this part here of 20 decibels. And here it is. This is for 10, 20 decibels. This is always 10 for all frequencies. The second element that we have is 20 log of a real pole. And this pole is has and this pole has a cutoff frequency of 0.1 radians per second, that is 10 to the power of 1 right here. We know that for a real pole, up to the cutoff frequency, the magnitude of the body plot is zero, and past the cutoff frequency, the body plot starts to decay by a factor of 20 decibels per decade. The cutoff frequency is 0 0.1, that is 10 to the power of 1. So from any frequency below the cutoff frequency, the gain is 0. At the cutoff frequency specifically, the gain is negative 3 decibels, which starts to decay. And past the cutoff frequency, now it goes down by a factor of 20 decibels per decade. So at 10 to the power of 1, we should be roughly at around negative 20 dB. And at 10 to the power of 1, we should be at negative 40 dB, roughly. Notice that here, at the cutoff frequency, the gain is negative 3 decibels. So here, we should be at a 20 decibels, which is this distance. We, went, we increased the frequency by a factor of 10. The body plot decreases by a factor of 20, hence negative 20 decibels, minus that 3. So here we should be at around 23 dB, if we account for this negative 3 decibels. And this is coming from 1 over s over 0 0.1 plus 1. Now what is the body plot of the combined function? These two elements added together, basically. So this curve plus that curve. We can now simply add them together from 10 to the power of negative 2 to 10 to the power of negative 1. We have 0 plus 20, so that's going to be always 20. At 10 to the power of negative 1, which is the cutoff frequency, we have negative 3 plus 20, so we are around negative 17 dB. And now the body plot will go down by 20 decibels per decade. At 10, we were at negative 23. Negative 23 plus 20 is around negative 3 dB, so it should be around here. At 10 to the power of negative 1, now we go down by, so this is negative 3 dB. We go down by another 20 dB, so we go down to negative 23. And at 10 to the power of negative 2, we should be roughly at negative 43. So this curve here is the curve for 1 over s over 0 0.1 plus 1. And this curve here is this plus 10, which gives g of s the original function. Again, here we are considering this negative 3 dB that occurs exactly at the cutoff frequency for a real pole. But if we disregard this just to make a simpler analysis, from 10 to the minus 2 to 10 to the minus 1, we are at 0. Past 10 to the minus 1, it goes down by 20 decibels per decade. So here we should be at 
20 minus 20 is 0. 0 minus 20 minus 20 here, because we increase the frequency by a factor of 10. And you increase the, this frequency again by a factor of 10, we go down by another 20 decibels, that is negative 40 dB. Because we consider this negative 3 dB here at the cutoff frequency, then everything is further shifted down by 3 decibels. Now, what is the phase? For the phase, we can look at a constant gain. The phase for a constant gain is always zero. And the phase for a real pole goes from zero to negative 90 degrees at the cutoff frequency. So before the cutoff frequency, the phase is zero. At the cutoff frequency, it will shift to negative 90 degrees and it will stay at negative 90 degrees. Now we can interpolate this curve. And you know that this curve will go like this, tending to negative 90 degrees. And you pass at negative 45 degrees at the cutoff frequency. And this is now the phase for the function g of s.